Hello everyone and welcome back to another tutorial. In today's tutorial we are going to be building up a simple raised oak house. So let's get straight into it. Now everyone, the resource count for this build is in this chest right here. You can see there are wheat seeds and potatoes. These can of course be any plantable crop that you may have and it doesn't necessarily need to be just wheat and potatoes potatoes you can of course do all four types of crops or even just one it is completely up to you you just need this amount combined and of course this bed can be any color you want it to be the first step you need to do is find your lower left hand corner and place your stripped spruce logs there then skip three blocks and place another stripped log skip three blocks again place another one three blocks again another one three blocks again another one and then you're gonna turn left here another one and then continue another three blocks and then you should be able to match them up right here next you want to take your composter and place it in the exact center it should be three blocks from each of these center ones and three blocks diagonally from each of the corner ones now you're going to want to build each of these pillars up by four While you're still on one of them, you need to build up the center ones one extra high. So do that now. And while you're still up here, you want to go one under the shortest pillar and place your stripped logs connecting them like this. When you stand on it, there should be two for the middle pillar and then one above it for the lower pillar. Then you want to repeat this to connect all of the pillars. Now go over to your composter and build it up three, and then you'll notice that it is flush with the level that you have your connection pillars, and you're going to want to connect each of the middle ones with this one like so. While you're up here, you're also going to want to place your oak slabs on the top half of this block. This will fill in your floor and give you a nice platform on this level. Now it is time to put in your railings. So you're going to want to place stairs like this where each of the pillars are and then repeat this for the remaining ones. Now you're going to want to cap off these pillars here with slabs. So place your oak slabs on top of them to give them a nice little cap and then use some of your remaining oak slabs to place right in between your stairs like this. Now in your back right corner of your build you're going to break out the slab here as this will be where you get up go under your build and you're going to want to frame out your pillars like this with a couple of stairs just like you did on the top except here we will not be adding slabs between them again go to your back right area and remove the stairs there because you do not need them there go to the outside and place trapdoors like this and then close those trapdoors. Go to the front side of it, that is inside the actual rays itself, and you'll notice that you can place th your three ladders on these trapdoors here, and you'll want to place another trapdoor up here so that way you can get up and down safely. Now you will want to go to everywhere that is not the entrance, that is the side that is exactly opposite where your ladder is, and you're going to want to place leaves all along here to frame out your build just like this. Now take your remaining trapdoors and place them along here like this and then close them. That way you will have a nice sort of wall along here which in order to get to this other area you need to just only open a trapdoor and walk over it. Now you're going to want to take your lanterns and place them right here. This will light the area up so that way no mobs can spawn and also you just have some light down here. Now you're going to want to take your wooden hoe and hoe the entire land within this segment over here that is opposite your entrance segment. Now you may be asking how exactly are these crops going to be watered. As you can see here they're already starting to decay. So what you're going to want to do is go right under your composter and place a bucket of water there. That will irrigate this entire area and you can always go back and change the rest of this area into farmland once you have that water in place. Now it is time to plant your crops in however you want. I will be doing it where I have a row of wheat and then a row 
of potatoes in between the row of wheat. This is the most efficient way to grow crops as they grow faster this way. If you don't believe me, there are plenty of videos on YouTube that explain this. However, the way that you decide to plant your crops is completely up to you. Now you want to go up to your second level as it is now time to build up the actual house part of this house tutorial. So in each corner right here as you can see, leaving one block gap to walk around it, you are going to place an oak log and then in between them you're going to place cobblestone. Now on the front side of your build, that is the side where you have your entrance where you walk into that is opposite your ladder side, you're going to leave the center block open for your door. Now you're going to bring your oak logs up three more. And while you're still up at the top, you're going to bring the logs over to connect them like this. Then drop down, go to your entrance, place oak stairs like this here. And then go to your sides, place oak stairs like this, like I'm doing like this. And then connect them in the center and repeat this on the other two sides. Now get up to the top of your house part and place cobblestone slabs here and here. Then place a cobblestone block right here, connecting the two. Then you're going to place oak stairs here and here, with one facing like this, go up like this, place one facing this direction, and then one facing like this, and repeat these on the other side. Now, while you're still up here, you'll want to place an oak plank right here. And now bring two cobblestone stairs over like this to meet up in the center, and then place a cobblestone block in the middle of them. Now you'll want to take your oak stairs and fill them in right along here on all four sides. Now, for the interior of your house, you're going to want to go in here and place bottom slabs along this level right here. And then fill this wall with chests here, and then fill the remaining part of this wall with chests as well. Go over to this wall, place your crafting table with a stone cutter on top, with your bed right here, a grindstone above that, with a loom, two furnaces here, and then finally a lantern right above in the middle. Then when you step out of your house, you're going to want to add the last four lanterns onto this build right under here. Now everyone, if you found this video helpful, please do consider leaving a like rating on it so more people can find this video helpful. And if you're not already subscribed and you enjoy my content, please do consider subscribing. And if you're new to the channel, please do consider checking out some of the other things I do here, because I do have some other series I do on the channel other than just tutorials. Anyways guys, thanks for watching this video, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.